Hi, Ryan Byrne here with a quick tutorial on how to perform a tolerance analysis on a circuit card in Creo Parametric. First, as always, close all other windows currently running in the background before starting. Then to make the dimensions easier to see on the model, go to the ribbon and select File, then Options. In the dialog box that appears, select the Model Display tab. Then deselect the box labeled Enable Transparency. Here we have a basic circuit card assembly complete with a PCB board, plug, and housing. The tolerance analysis will be performed to determine whether the PCB properly fits into this assembly. Various dimensions and measurements will be conducted in order to see if the board fits into those constraints. Select the measurement references followed by the pan length desired. For a set of holes, select the position tolerance for each pattern, then the hole diameter. A dialog box appears, where you will then have to specify whether the dimensions you just entered are for a hole or a pin. Screws or pins can be referenced by first selecting the part, then the major diameter thread. They too will have this dialog box. Clicking on the PCB board will display its candidate dimensions. I then select the diameter of the hole and the hole option in the dialog box. Repeat this process for any other holes in your assembly. When I have finished, the endpoint of the basic dimension will be aligned with the second measurement reference. Thus, the dimension loop is complete. I can select the Generate Report button and click the green check. All the data compiled is now shown in Creo's embedded browser. Tolerance reports are useful tools for assessing the size and fit of a part, and whether or not it fits into its assembly. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. This is Ryan Byrne from LearningExchange.ptc.com. Feel free to check out more content from PTC University or at LearningExchange.ptc.com. Thanks.